He is a snack, isn't he, dear? Care to join? More the merrier. No, thank you. Oh, have I embarrassed you? I'm sorry, I do have that effect on people. I'll wait for you, but make it quick. I must admit, I admire your persistence. Almost curious what you do after I send you packing, yet again. You'll regret it. Sixteen-year-old Highland single malt. Modeled the year before the pandemic broke out. I've read that one barrel of this stuff sold at auction for over half a million dollars. Huh. What a sublime present. What can I say? You broke down my defenses. So, you're still after those lamps. Did Matt tell you why he wanted them? Why he really wanted them? Yeah, to take control of the TV tower. Wait, he's serious? Is he crazy? Nobody tried that for over a decade. So I guess it's dangerous. That's what the lamps are for. But lamps need electricity to run. The last I heard, the juice ain't flowing there. People have tried to take it without power. Heroes and fools alike. All ended up as volatile snacks. That's Matt's problem. What do you care? I care because something's not right. Can't you sense that as well, Aiden? Matt wants to prepare to defend the city from the Butcher's coming attack. So, we should start building him a monument, right? Only problem? The Butcher isn't planning any attack. How do you know? I have my spies. Among the Renegades as well. Since the end of the war, we have occupied the city center. While the Colonel squats in the dam. One push of a lever. And half the city will find itself under toxic water. The Colonel is not stupid. He knows war would be the end of everything. So why did the Butcher attack the canteen? That's in the city center. Good question. Maybe it wasn't the Colonel who gave the order. Something more is going on. It's something we don't yet understand. What about the UV lamps? Why does he want them then? Jack is hiding something. For a while now, he's been ordering way more lamps than he could possibly need. And then some of those lamps always disappear. No accounting for them once we deliver. Why would Jack skim UV lamps? And here, friend, the mystery takes flight. Jack never got over the fact that he didn't defeat the Butcher back when he had the chance, years ago. He knew that if he attacked the dam, the Colonel would close the floodgates, and the rising water levels would push the chemicals up out of the ground, burning through everything that lives in the city. It's been a stalemate for over ten years, each waiting for the other to make a move. But then, someone turned the power on and something changed, and the Renegades attacked the canteen. I'm not here for my health, Juan. I need the lamps to- To find out what happened to your sister, Right, Aiden? I told you I got my spies. Might be able to find something out about Waltz and your sister. Specifically about the GRE scientist you and Matt are trying to contact. I'd even say with my resources I can find this person faster than Matt. I actually doubt he's able to find them at all. Let's help each other. Smart man, Aiden. Barely in town a minute and you've picked the right side already. 
I'll give you the lamps. That'll keep Matt from getting suspicious. But then, go to the cathedral. There's a guy hiding out there. Total nut job, but a tech savant. Get him to fix this old piece of spy tech. If we get it working, we can bug the transmitter Jack wants to place on top of the VNC spire. Have him do his thing. By tapping Matt's comms, we'll find out what he's doing with the extra lamps. And knowing he's half the battle, kiddo. I'm at the transmitter. What's next? Good. Good. Now throw the switch, and that's it. It worked! Great. And listen, Ray, but it's... Juan. Sorry, friend. I appreciate... I see it. Over. Now I just have to connect the bug to Jack's transmitter. How you do? Job's done, Matt. Good. Rope, don't... Juan, did what you wanted. You did the right thing. What about your part of the deal? Don't think I've forgotten, Aiden. I'll contact you soon. Peacekeeper's mission is to serve the city and exterminate the infected. Tired of chaos? Do you believe in order? It's time for you to act. Join the Peacekeepers. The key to bringing order to the city might be you. Enlist today. Juan? Juan, wait. And you're Aiden, I presume. Nice to finally meet you. Stay out of this, Aiden. As you can see, we're having a sort of standoff. Call off your man, Williams. Why? So that you can kill me? Trust me, you don't want to kill me. If you do, you'll never stop the next missile strike. Shut up, asshole. Wait, what are you talking about? Let my wife go, and I'll explain everything. I won't leave you here. The Juan? Hey, what's this next missile strike you're talking about? The failsafe protocol I stopped years ago has been reactivated. What the hell does that mean? It means bombs being dropped on our heads to destroy the contamination zone, like in other cities. It's not over yet. Bullshit. He's lying like he always does. You think Villador survived accidentally? Kill me and you'll never stop the attack, Aiden. I won't let you hurt her. Shoot him, Luan. When... Are you coming with me? What do you think? Williams is dead. I told you this was our only chance. What's plan B? Let's face the facts. There's little chance that what you're attempting will succeed. No offense. If you can't stop Walsh, I'll ride off into the sunset. Far from this fucking city, missiles, and death. You, you should join me. After all, you're a pilgrim. You know how to survive out there. I'm too close, Juan. I have to get Waltz. Oh, bravery and stupidity in equal parts. Okay. Get in. I'll take the other car. Are you all right? Are you crazy? Of course not. I hate blood, especially the sight of my own, for Christ's sake. Renegades killing renegades. Peacekeepers killing peacekeepers. That's where we've ended up. Another attack. Williams was right. Of course he was. We need to get the key from Waltz before he destroys the entire city. Guess now all our fates are in your hands. You stupid, brave, and dare I say handsome fool. Watch out. This cloud is a whirling miasma of chemicals. It's likely to kill you. Or turn you into a monster. It's too late to worry about that one. She will destroy everything. Launch countdown procedure incomplete. Aiden, I've got the explosives. But they need to be detonated manually. I... 
I can do this. You just have to get out of here. If she destroys X-13, you will lose everyone. Everyone you love. I'm ready to set up the explosives. Run! Is this city really worth you losing everything? Luan, you're the strongest person I've ever known. I know, I know. Just take Mia and leave. You'll save her, Aiden. You'll find a way. I know you will. I'm sorry. I failed you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Follow the evacuation route to the nearest exit. I got you. You're safe. Aiden! We're getting out of here, Luan. on with you? He's gonna get you out of there.
live the free city of Villador. Yeah, until we wake up from this beautiful dream and fuck everything up again. What's your poison? Beer, but only if it's not flat. Not bad. A package from Baines. For Juan Rayner. Oh, it's not so easy to reach him in his gilded cage. After the last food shortage protests, he locked himself away, shitting his pants due to the threat of mutiny. The soldiers will kill anyone who got near five kilometers to the ship. Whatever he's up to, he's got a lot of good whiskey with him. Have any of my people passed through recently? You mean a pilgrim? Why do you ask? I'm looking for a friend. Thought he was coming here. The pilgrim was here, but not anymore. Where'd he go? Wherever the road took him. Same as the rest of you. Did he find what he was looking for here? From what I've heard, yeah. His sister. But they said she was so weak, she lived only for a couple more hours. He stayed with her, buried her under an old oak tree. Then he turned toward the horizon and kept on walking. Poor guy. If it wasn't for him, there wouldn't be a single brick still standing in this city. So why didn't he stay? They said he was starting to change, taking a drug that was destroying him. People like him are better off on the road. <laughs> 